Hey, is this C. Boston? This is me. How are you? Can I still call you Stone Cold? You can call me Stone Cold or you can call me Steve, whatever you want. I like Stone Cold. That's so cool. That is so, so very cool. I can well, roll with it. I want to let you know, I talked to you a couple years ago, and you were satellite. You got the most hits on my side. I had, I think you had like 130,000 or something like that, and that's real big for me. <laughs> <laughs> People really like you. I don't know why, but I'm glad they do. I think because you're authentic. I, yeah. really, I really believe that is what it is. I've never seen you out of uh, not being what I know to be Steve Austin when I see you in the media. So I think you're authentic. That's what we like about people. I think that's the best way to be in life. I don't want to be anybody that I am not. All right. So they told me you love the smell of combat in the morning. Tell me what that means, Steve Austin. I tell you what, uh, you know, I had a great time. I created this show. It's called the Broken Skull Challenge. And uh, you know, I've hosted a lot of reality television shows in the past that were competitive in nature. Uh, but I wanted something where performance talked and BS walked. I wanted to do something because I'm a competitive person. Through anything I've ever done, I like to be number one. So I wanted to set the table each week at my ranch, the Broken Skull Ranch, to bring 80 lead athletes and let them compete. And if you win, you stick around. If you lose, you go home. At the end of the day, after eight people are there, one person is left standing. The next day, that one person will take on my personal obstacle course, which I named the Skull Buster. And when you run the Skull Buster, whether you're a man or you're a woman, it attacks different parts of the body. And then after it attacks parts of the body, starts creeping up in your mind and makes you doubt yourself. If you're tough enough to beat my course, I will give you $10,000. If someone has already beaten the course, if you beat their time, I will give you their $10,000 and you become my returning champion. This show was all about me setting the table for the elite athletes from the world of CrossFit, Tough Mudder, Spartan races, MMA, pro wrestling, pro football, to come and be the stars. I set the table, they perform and kick ass. So they just gotta be an elite athlete in any sport. Absolutely. I mean, you know, and, and most of these people are competitive people, whether it was the men or the women, they all love to challenge They're alpha males and alpha females. And it's put up or shut up. Well, I like this because it, you know, it makes more sense than just running that little marathon to the end of the line. You're I like exactly this. right. Each, and, and you got head to head competition. There's not another show on television that's like this. There's nothing fancy about the show. The competition is tough. The challenges are tough, and we weed through the weak, and we find the strong. And when I say strong, I don't mean just like you got to be physically strong, physically fit, have strength, endurance, stamina, but you also need heart, and you need to have a lot of mental toughness because if you don't have mental toughness, you will not survive. Okay, you're on CMT. Where's your ranch? Tell me, could you tell me what state it's in? Because see, if it was in Texas, you'd probably lose a lot of people. So where's your ranch? Well, the ranch, my ranch is in, uh, Broken Skull Ranch is in South Texas. Now, oh, for no, for, it is. It's yeah. hot in Texas, Steve. Oh, it's hot in Texas. And everything that grows out there has a thorn on it. It will cut you, stick you, or hurt you. It's the toughest ranch in Texas. Oh, wow, that's going to be so challenging. Now, this is a true challenge. So is this really making reality TV, reality TV? Now, this is about as real as it gets. And, you know, when the people come, you can train, and you can be a CrossFitter, and you can train specifically for any uh, your specific activity that you love. But once you come to the Broken Skull Challenge, I'm throwing everything at you but the kitchen sink. You never know exactly what you're doing until you roll up on that situation. Then all of a sudden, if you're that one person who has lasted three rounds and we're standing on the top of a cliff and you're looking down at the skull buster and it looks like one thing, but when you get in the middle of it and you're trying to accomplish each obstacle along the way, it's tough as nails. So it's a tough task for tough-minded people with physical skills and mental toughness. Okay, I just got to cheat just a little bit because I want to know what are some of the obstacles that you have on the court? Can you give me a sneak peek? Well, I just say, you know, you, you, you might uh, need some uh, uh, ability in climbing a rope. You, you might need to jump over a wall. You, you might need to traverse uh, down a winding path with heavy objects. Uh, there, there's all kinds of things. Everything but the kitchen sink is what I throw at these athletes, and that's what they get. I'll tell you what, I've had some of the best athletes in the United States of America, and at the end of the day, look me right in the eye, whether it's a man or a woman, and say, that was badass. And that's when I know I was successful in creating a tough show for tough people. 
I can't wait. You think you're going to have any of your former wrestling buddies on there? Someone asked that the other day. They said, out of the WWE roster, who might be able to get through the Skull Buster? And I said, Seth Rollins, because he has a CrossFit background, and also Antonio Cesaro, because he's just a supreme badass athlete. So it would be great to have the WWE superstars come run through a round of the Broken Skull Challenge. That would be cool. Tell us when you want us to watch. We know you're on CMT. When do you want us to watch? Oh, it's, uh, i got a season premiere. It's going to be July 6th, 8 p.m. Eastern. There's going to be a replay at 9 p.m. Eastern. So check it out and set your DVR, too. I can't wait. I'm going to be your vicarious athlete, and I will be watching. <laughs> Thank you so much, Steve Austin. I can't wait to see this. This is going to be good. Thank you very much.